Welcome back. This is your Feel Good Breakfast Show Expresso on SABC3. On this Tuesday morning, it's Medical Tuesday, hanging out with Dr. Darren Green, and we're talking all about allergies. And our phone lines are open on 0839133728. And we're learning all about these new things, allergens and anaphylaxis. Yes, and, uh, yes. But what, I've, what, what has been said is that over the past couple of years, over in fact, the last 30 years, that uh, fevers and eczema and those kinds of allergies and um, have trebled. What's going on with us as a human I think race? a lot of it's got to do, so you, you get environmental allergy, so things in the air like pollen. Uh, we must remember that insecticides and food production, yeah. the need for food has become more and more with our population explosion. So our air is now being polluted with all of these things. Our air is contaminated that... and obviously the industrial uh, products, etc., of oil refineries and so yeah. forth are also in the air. And then you have with that obviously the awareness of food. and. The engineering of food, and when food is maximized by adding things to it that isn't necessarily nutritious, you can imagine there's a lot more preservatives in food. Yeah. So you've got to be vigilant with what's in the product you're eating. Yeah. And that obviously results then in a lot of kids having eczema, a lot yeah. of uh, people that never knew they had allergies, sure. developing allergies. Okay, we've got a call on the line right sure. now. Lung Gile from Johannesburg. Good morning to you, and what is your question to the doctor? Hi, um, how are you today? I'm very well, how are you? I'm good. Um, my question was, I have a skin problem for my hands, and when I get exposed to powder soap or dishwasher, my my hands go pimply and rashy, and they sometimes crack when I don't moisturize them. Mm, okay. Well, they, maybe yeah. one of the more common things that happen as well. Very so w what's happening there? So she's got what's called a, a contact dermatitis. Her hand is making contact with the detergent or the soap, mm -hmm. and she's got a reaction or an allergy to the actual soap. So she is not meant, she's meant to be a princess. She's not meant to wash dishes. <laughs> she must get a dishwasher <laughs> <laughs> and ask her boyfriend. Uh, Dr. Darren Greenwald Chama this morning as well. <laughs> so I think that's very important. Uh, so contact dermatitis, mm. certain soaps, perfumes, uh, and, and products in the soaps are, can cause uh, definitely uh, a skin reaction. Yeah, yeah. And so how do you handle that? Shampoos, etc., as well, also do the same between the fingers. Yes, yes, yes. So what, you've obviously got to limit your exposure to it. Change your shampoo. Go Use something that doesn't contain as many preservatives in it. You can actually find out eventually which specific preservative it is. Mm -hmm. Also, uh, wear a glove. Mm -hmm. when, you, when you're washing dishes. Exactly. That's a simple one. Uh, when you're washing your hair with shampoo, mm -hmm. etc. remember to do that. But often, if the irritation is on the surface of your hands, it means that the rest of your body might also be sensitive yeah. to it. So watch your scalp as well. Okay. Thank you very much, Dr. Darren Green, talking allergies today on this Medical Tuesday. And we'll be taking calls a little bit later on on that number 0839133728. But I think somebody that we'll never, ever be allergic to is Miss Zoe Brown.